morning and welcome to Cincy Lifestyle. And no, your eyes aren't deceiving you. Yes, <laughs> I am in the studio today, not from home. And my work daughter, Allie, is joining us. Hey, Mona. <laughs> Hey, Allie. You know, Clyde has the day off. And of course, our work daughter steps up to the plate. Yeah, it's a ladies edition. And we kind of have a fun ladies story at the top of the show today. So, Mona, I have a question for you. When was the last time that you sent or have done a handwritten letter to someone? You know what? I've made a habit since COVID of sending oh. handwritten cards to people. Okay, well, so that, that you're on trend. So listen to this. Oh, There's an 11 year old girl who was on the beach and taking a vacation with her family in Florida. And she wrote a letter, put it in a bottle and threw it out to sea. Two weeks later, the bottle traveled 700 miles up the coast to North Carolina, where another 11 year old girl found the bottle opened it up, read the letter, and they connected that way. So I don't know if, you know, if they connected over Facebook or if she put a, a, a number or something like that, but I thought that was just such a fun little story that these two 11-year-old girls bonded over a message in a bottle. <laughs> and now they're the best of friends. Yeah, yeah, which I think is fun. And they both have the same initials, which was cute. It gave me a little bit of a heart attack watching the girl throw the plastic bottle in the ocean. So I'm very <laughs> glad that it made it back to shore and somebody found it. But I thought that was just a really fun way to start the top of our show today. I love that. All about yeah. friendship. Yeah, yeah, Well, yeah. I've got a question for you now. <laughs> have you ever heard of an aura? Well, it's the colorful energy field that many believe surrounds people and animals. So how do you get in touch with your aura? And for that, we went to an expert. Of course, I want to welcome Susie Frigo, the founder and aura alchemist at Essence of Aura. Thank you so much for talking to us, Susie. Thank you for having me. Absolutely. So first, tell us a little bit about what an aura is and how it Oh, interacts with people. Okay, so you walk into a room and you pick up on those vibes, you instantly know like that person's really happy or that person might be dangerous. You're you're picking up on their energy and that's the electromagnetic field around them, that's their aura. Um, and it has all their energetic field information in them. You know, that's funny you say that because that's true. You really do can feel if there's danger or feel, you know, what someone's mood might be. So auras present in different colors and frequencies. So what do the colors mean? So there's red, orange, yellow, green, blue, violet, and indigo. And each one represents different feelings, thoughts, emotions. So if you have a lot of orange in your aura, you're probably a creative, confident, um, outgoing people person. If you're yellow, you um, are probably joyful and whimsical with like childlike personality. And then this also changes based on where in your aura these colors are representing. So if it's over your head, it means something different than if it's on your left or right side. And um, when I read an aura, we go really in depth with what these meanings, where these auras are and what they mean. So do it's multiple colors that are involved or do you have just one color? So you have um, a field of energy, there's seven of them and they go out. The bottom four are your life energy. They don't typically change and then the outside ones, they do change based on your mood or your circumstances. And that is what um, I read. Okay, T tell us quickly, we just have a couple seconds left. You're an aura alchemist, <laughs> what does that mean? Yeah, so I'm a metaphysical practitioner. I've been doing this for 10 years. Um, so as an aura alchemist, I use your aura to channel into um, channel into who you are and use this information to help you navigate your purpose in this world. All right, Susie, tell us where people can get more information and get their aura read and connect with you. Yes, yeah, so you can get um, aura photography pictures. You can get your aura read at www.essenceofaura.com. And I'm also really active on Instagram, Essence of Aura. All right, Susie, thank you so much for talking to us.
Thank you so much for having me. Absolutely. Allie? Well, summer is in full swing. And joining us today with her favorite summertime essentials is lifestyle expert Lee Moore Suss. Hey guys, it's Lee Moore Suss, and today we're talking all about summer essentials from an outdoor protector to a summer snack and a way to get rid of those bug bites. First up, we have Cinemood 360, which is a handheld portable projector that sets a new standard for safe, active screen time for kids. It's compatible with Netflix, Amazon Prime, YouTube, and brand new, you can now stream it on Disney+. It comes preloaded with content for kids, including educational content, interactive motion games, and fun videos. It also comes preloaded with 360 degree content, so you can turn your walls into scenes and explore national parks, galaxies, and more. It projects up to 12 feet in the dark. Visit cinemood.com for more information. Now let's talk summer snacks. My kids love yogurt, and I'm so excited about these YoPlay flavors. These new YoPlay Gushers with bursting bubble heads taste just like their favorite Gushers fruit snacks. And new Gogurt Slushy has the same iconic taste and fizzing texture of a blue raspberry or cherry slushy. How delicious does that sound? Not only does yogurt have calcium and vitamin D, but it makes snack time fun with flavors and varieties they're excited to try. You can find these snacks at grocery retailers nationwide this August. I love summer, but I hate getting bug bites. So I have a great product you may have seen on Shark Tank last year, Bug Bite Thing. Bug Bite Thing uses suction to extract insect saliva and venom from underneath the skin and eliminates the itching, swelling, and pain caused by mosquito bites and bee stings. Bug Bite Thing is completely chemical-free, reusable, and safe to use on children and adults and it's Amazon's number one selling product for insect bite relief. You can get Bug Bite Thing for under $10, plus you can get free shipping on bugbitething.com. What summer without some ice cream? You're going to love these Fat Boy ice cream sandwiches. Fat Boy is part of the legacy family-owned brand Casper's Ice Cream, who is celebrating their 95th anniversary this July. Fat Boy ice cream sandwiches stuffed with premium vanilla ice cream are their signature best-selling sweet treat that have been loved by families since the company's inception. The company recently released new gluten-free ice cream sandwiches so that people with dietary restrictions can still enjoy the beloved confections. Starting at $5.99 a box, you can find them at grocery stores nationwide. Visit shop.caspersicecream.com for more information. I'm Lee Marsalis. Those are some of my summer essentials. Back to you guys in the studio. Thanks, Limor. And for more information, visit LimorLove.com and make sure to follow Limor on Instagram at LimorSus. Mona? All right. Well, most of us have an old waffle iron around the house, but how often do you really make waffles? Well, in honor of National Waffle Iron Day, we wanted to show you a few unconventional recipes for that old iron that may inspire you. Take a look.
Oh my goodness. All of a sudden I'm having a craving for cinnamon rolls. <laughs> well, coming up here on Cincy Lifestyle, get ready for your next adventure in life. We talk to a local senior living community about all the fun and care they provide without sacrificing the safety of your loved ones. Plus, we go behind the scenes at a local distillery that is creating customized spirits. It's called Brain Brew Whiskey, and we'll tell you all about it after the break. When it comes to caring for an aging loved one, you want to make sure that they are living somewhere that puts their health and happiness first, which is exactly what Artist Senior Living does, especially during these difficult times. And right now, I want to welcome our guest, Margaret Unger, the Director of Marketing at Artist Senior Living. Thank you so much for talking to us, Margaret. And I want to jump right in. So how will people or family members know when it's the right time to move into a senior living community? The right time for a family to decide to move into a memory care community is basically when it's not safe for their loved one to remain at home. Um, it's a very difficult decision, but my job here at Artis is to ensure that families have all of the assistance that they need to make this very difficult decision. As a daughter of someone who had dementia, I know how difficult of a decision it can be, but at Artist Senior Living of Bridgetown, we are here to assist them in any way possible. So um, how, what kind of advice do you have for someone caring for a family member at home? Basically, get all the resources that you can get. For example, the Alzheimer's Association is a great resource. One of the ways that Artist Senior Living of Bridgetown, we assist folks out in the community, is right now we are conducting a virtual memory care support meeting that was held the third Wednesday of every month. It's one of our ways that we are able to assist families who do not have a resident here, but need assistance in dealing with this very difficult disease. All right, you know, in these uh, times that we're living in now, talk about how you're keeping your residents and employees safe. Well, of course, we are doing all of the protocols of as soon as someone enters our community, um, their temperature is taken and there is a uh, process of a documentation that we ask to make sure that uh, if they're exhibiting any kind of symptoms, that they are not allowed in the community. In addition, everyone has to wear a mask. And of course, we have sanitizing stations all throughout the community where uh, residents and our associates, everyone um, cleans their hands all the time, make sure that we are following all the guidelines that we are doing to make sure that our uh, community is safe. All right, sounds good, Margaret. Tell us how people can connect with artists in your living. They can contact me via phone. Right now I am conducting virtual tours, so I would be more than happy to assist a family if they are uh, wanting to see what we're all about. One of the ways that we are different from most communities is we have a specialized position here. Um, it's the director of the Artist Way, and her job is to ensure that the transition from home to our community is as smooth as possible. That sounds great. Margaret, thank you so much for talking to us today. Well, thank you so much for having me, Mona. It's been really nice uh, talking to you today. While bourbon whiskey has been distilled since the 18th century, this drink has been on the upswing with the younger generation. But a unique distillery is trying to make this spirit more approachable for everyone. It's called Brain Brew. Take a look. So I am right now here with Philip, Doug, and Joe, and we are at Brain Brew. Now, Doug, you are the mastermind behind Brain Brew. Tell us what it is. Um, we're a custom whiskey company. Um, we're taking people back to before Prohibition. Cincinnati was the place where 80% of the whiskey came from, and people used to make your own whiskey. You'd go to one of the whiskey makers, you'd put some barrels together, and you'd make your own whiskey. And we're bringing that back to life here in Cincinnati today. And it was a hobby. 
that has quickly gotten out of control. <laughs> out of control, but with a lot of precision. Brain Brew has managed to replicate nature with a process called wood craft finishing. So rather than creating a whiskey that ages for six to eight years, Brain Brew pretty much pressure cooks their whiskey in 40 minutes. Yes, I said 40 minutes. And you can best believe that Doug and the team has seen every reaction in the book. People that are into bourbon, they start out usually like this, very, yeah. you know, oh, what are you doing here in Newtown, Ohio? Or, How could this be anything? And then we said, well, just try it. They go, this is, a, this is kind of amazing. Because yeah. the flavor is very complex, but clean. Mm -hmm. So it's not gnarly, it's very clean and it works. But those that are new to bourbon are blown away that they finally, for the first time, there's a bourbon they like. Mm -hmm. They'll use the cherry wood, they'll use the maple wood. Because when you say a bourbon they like, it's their bourbon. That's right. right. So there's a difference. That's this is key here. Yes, you can buy one of their pre-made bourbons, but Brain Brew gives you the opportunity to customize your very own bourbon to your palate. This includes sampling six bourbons in which they've created using local woods, such as cherry, maple, and 200-year American oak, and then combine them to create that perfect blend. You can do this by either participating in one of their two-hour experiential tastings, or if you're short on time, you can use their handy-dandy wizard app that will guide you with a series of questions. How much do you like a smoke taste in your whiskey or foods? I do, I like it. No matter what level of whiskey drinker you are, we'll work with you and you'll love it still. No matter if you're in the high level, you have tons of different bottles and you know exactly what you want to do, or you've really only had whiskey a couple times. What is the one thing that you want people to know about what you're doing here? That we're about and not or. We're about bringing people together. You know, this industry fights, should it be spelt whiskey with an E or without an E? Should you have it neat or on the rocks? And the answer is yes, yes, and yes. And it's non-intimidating, demystify it. Um, it's a fun, it's the product of America, it's the official, you know, bourbon is something that can only be made in America. And uh, have some friends and have some fun. And if you want to pick up your own custom bourbon by the bottle, you can find Brain Brew Whiskey online or just stop by their distillery at Eureka Ranch. It's in Newtown. All right, well, we'll be back with more Cincy Lifestyle on the other side of the break. Plus, Cincy Lifestyle has full episodes of the show up on YouTube. So find fun segments you've never seen before or watch your favorites again and again. So subscribe now on youtube.com slash Cincy Lifestyle. Well, today's weather theme is hot, humidity, and our dew point <laughs> sits in the low 70s. You know, temperatures are going to warm to 87, but the Ooh. oppressive humidity will make it feel like it's 95 degrees outside. Some isolated oh storms goodness. will pop up on the radar, mainly after 2 p.m., though. So uh, stay inside if you can. <laughs> Yeah, Mona, I must admit, this is the one perk of working from home. When we talk about the weather, I can actually look out the window and, and see what's going on. But, uh, right. you know, with that said, a lot of people are out and about walking these days. So coming up tomorrow here on Cincy Lifestyle, are your sneakers helping or hurting you? We'll talk to a local running store to see what questions you need to ask when buying a pair of sneakers for walking or running. And then... It's National Meteor Watch Day. <laughs> the astronomer for the Cincinnati Observatory will talk to us about what meteors are and other great things you can see in the night sky. We have all that so much more happening tomorrow right here on Cincy Lifestyle. Hey, Allie, you know, yes, I'm Mona. still <laughs> thinking about <laughs> those ice cream sandwiches that we saw. For, um, oh, my goodness. They were so good. They ice cream so sandwiches good. and cinnamon rolls. Yes, what was up with that? Yes. Hey, <laughs> We're not shout out to Helen. <laughs> yeah, shout thank out to you, Helen. Our, yeah, our, our producer. <laughs> That's right. And 
And that's Scentsy Lifestyle for Monday, June 29th. And remember, if you know a unique local business or product we should feature, give us a shout out. We would love to hear from you. And as always, you know, make it a great day. <laughs>Hey, thank you so much for watching our video. Now, if you like what you saw, hit the subscribe button. You can also check out full episodes of the show you've never seen before or watch your favorites again and again. And as always, be sure to make it a great day.